What's up, people? So we're out here in the barn today. Matt is getting ready to head down to South Texas, so it's time to catch us some animals. All right, guys, so I want to start the video out this way by catching these animals. I know it's easier to catch chickens while they're roosting at night, but I like to make things interesting. It makes for good content, gives you guys a good laugh. So I'm gonna go grab some fishing uh, nets. We're gonna try to catch us some chickens. All right, so we got Jared out here with a fishing net. He's gonna try to scoop up some hens. Yes, we should have done this last night when they were roosting, but neither one of us wanted to come do that. Well, I say I like doing things the hard way. I don't want to give up any of my gray hens, but since it's for mom and dad, there's one in the nesting box right now. So I'm gonna try to just grab her with my hands. Hi, baby girl. You ready for your new home? Ready for your new home? It's my tractor supply bird. Beautiful hen. They lay the big light brown eggs. These are pretty tame. The other ones are a little bit more wild, but dad, this is hen number one. So we put some hay in here in the kennel just so the animals don't slip around too much. They've all eaten breakfast already, so they should be good for the trip. Say goodbye to your friends. All right, guys, back it up. Watch out, Daisy. I may only be able to fit three in here comfortably, which I'm sure dad's fine with that. That was the easy one. It was uh, in the nesting box, so. The next one we're gonna have to do with like a dog catcher with a net. If I can get four of them, that'd be ideal. But we'll see what we can catch with that net. See how big the baby turkey is now over here? Yeah. Like double this size. These two right here are ones that I'd like to give dad too. Here's hen number two. Oh, big Beautiful birds. This one lays a lot too. Uh, this one was actually hatched out at the property, I think about a year ago. So, dad, there's hen number two. I'm being nice and giving dad some of my good hens. Because there are some of them out here that are, that'll peck you to death. Those are really nice ones. Let's go see what else we can catch. down in here all right dad I gave you two of my prized hens that I wanted to keep the two grays right here and then a, a brown one back there I don't know all the names from them all but those are three great hens they lay every day 
they're very nice the one's a little stressed right now because it was in a net but as you see they're already calm again hope you enjoy them let's go catch little bubba little bubba and blue are headbutting each other i think he's pretty ready to go see that's what i don't want i don't want him humping his mom it's all it takes a little handful y'all get back daisy emerald Get back, Tuck. Tucker, get back. Alright, Bubba. Get in, buddy. He's never been in a kennel before, so he doesn't know what's up. But, yeah. Beautiful goat. I know mom and dad will enjoy him. He'll be putting off nice babies soon because they have a bunch of, uh, I think they have pygmy goats over there. So, yeah. Miss this little guy, he's kinda, kinda mouthy, but beautiful little thing. You can see they got plenty of room. The chickens have less room, but they'll just sit down. He'll have enough room to spin around. But that's secured, that's secured. They should be good to go. Uh, Seven hours of that, Matt. Good luck. <coughs> it's okay, buddy. You're okay. It's okay, Bubba. <coughs> Bubba. <coughs> yeah. I knew he was gonna be a little mouthy, but it is what it is. So it is sad to see him go. I actually videotaped the day that he was born. I might link that one at the end of this video. But I know he's going to a great home. I know mom and dad will enjoy him. He's going to have, I think, five or six new girlfriends over there. So that would be awesome for him. And then uh, Blue over here will finally not have to fight over all the women. So he's going to have three women to himself over here. And little Bub is going to have about six women down there in South Texas. So I know it's uh, sad separating babies and stuff like that. But it's a part of life and he's going to have a great home. So that actually went a lot smoother than I thought. I know, once again, that it's easier to catch chickens at night. But I figured if I fed them all, they would all be in the barn and I can just use that net to scoop them up real quick. So um, I wanted to give dad more hens, but unfortunately with the space we had, I think three would be plenty. I'm sure he's going to be happy with that. Um, I know Matt will probably do an update video once he goes down there so you get to see him meeting all his new ladies and just see how the hens react down there. So I'm very happy with the way things turned out. Let's go send Matt on his way. Bye bye little buddy. <laughs> see you in a couple of months when I go down to South Texas, okay? You ladies be good. Bye. All right, guys. Matt will be back in a couple of weeks. Bye, Bubba. So it makes me happy to have a new home for Bubba and it's a good thing I can see it on YouTube because mom and dad have a YouTube channel, Crocker Simply Southern. If y'all want to keep up with little Bubba, go over there and subscribe. I'm sure they'll do some videos on him showing how he interacts with everybody and I know he's going to be in good hands. Seems like I have a lot of animals coming and going. Uh, actually had Diamond over here which was the mom of Tucker, Daisy and Emerald. She came over yesterday to play for a little while and then uh, Emerald's actually heading back home today. So, so like I said, a lot of uh, animals coming and going around here. <laughs> They're all out here playing. Come on, Emerald. Happy little things. All right guys, so that's gonna wrap up today's video. I just wanna do a quick short vlog today of loading up all the animals and sending Matt on his way. Y'all comment down below and wish him well for his trip. I gotta run into town and pick up some supplies for a Halloween party I'm gonna be going to tomorrow at At Home with Tom and Rhonda. So I may film a video there. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Peace.